Spanish. Yep. They also had gloves and Optum easily available for all clients. An easily accessible trash can. In the back here, sorry, I'm just gonna scoot you a little bit here. This is our employee repair section. We have employee manuals, cleaning supplies and office supplies, more supplies, and this is our defect saline drawer. And same with this one. On this side, with our other nice and cleanable displays, we have our uh, steam uh, cleaner. We also have our anodizing unit set up here. Uh, on the back, we do have a couple more drawers, but they mostly just contain glass plugs. Nobody ever really goes in this. It's mostly just for renovation supplies that we have. This room is our brand new piercing room here. It has a really sweet sliding door for ease of access. That barn door though. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Next to the mirror, we have another do not touch your piercing signs as well on the back of the door. All of our contaminated tools and our needles that get disposed of are in this one dirty area. Um, we have our enzyme spray also available. Pull down uh, is that thing? Paper towel. Thank you. Yes. <laughs> uh, we have a motion sensor tap. All of our supplies here are statum available. These two drawers are where we keep all of our tools that have been pre-sterilized and just need to be put in the statum again before use. All of our cleaning supplies and needed supplies for our piercings. There's not really anything kept under here. We have extra supplies up here. And our sterile gloves. More gloves. And nothing in this one. We have our gloves available and often available for ease of use as well. And a coat hook for clients. And a beautiful, beautiful color wall. Mm -hmm. uh, this is the employee's only office. No clients go in here at all. It's mostly just used for storage. Uh, we have just various things that still need to be put up or just we don't really know what to do currently with. Uh, this is our employee-only bathroom. Clients are not allowed in here. We just keep more storage supplies and a lot of our hardware and stuff for renovations. Mm -hmm. This is our little staff kitchen area, just for little things to heat up and snack on. Nothing too exciting. Uh, up top is a more storage space. We call it the lair. It's literally just for storage again. Things. This is our employee, or no, sorry, this is our client bathroom back here with more storage up on the top for all of our various different things that we need. In the back here we have even more storage things. This is our client bathroom with our hand washing signs and again please do not touch your piercing signs. are kept away in this little cupboard for the bathroom. This bad boy here is just where we keep all of our giant garbage cans that we have to have because we do not have a mega garbage can. This is technically the, the second piercing room that we have here. Again, with all of our Optum and enzyme sprays and needle disposals uh, available for use. Hand washing stations that are all hands-free as well. We have extra gloves on the bottom for uh, employees. This walks through 
to our decontamination room. Where the decontamination room is clearly delineated with two different colors, with the pink side being our dirty side and the green side being our clean side. We have a HEPA filter up on the top, our statum, an aquastat, and all of our jewelry nicely put away in organized containers. Again, with optum and gloves and all of our needed supplies for the piercings. In this cupboard here, it is just piercing supplies. This drawer has all of our needles and extra jewelry backstock and size placement rings. More jewelry backstock. And random bits and bobs such as extra needles uh, and our integrators. And behind here is just all of our little bags. PPE. And then on the dirty side, Underneath the sink is where we keep all of our full uh, biohazard boxes and they will be taken away by the company that we get. These are all of our tools that have been run through the hydrum already, so they are technically clean but not handled by bare hands and are statumed before use for any piercings. All of our tapers, sterilization pouches and receiving tubes, and just more sterilization pouches. And this is where we keep all of our backstock of extra tools and our cleaning uh, solution for our hydro. This continues into our first piercing room. That again has signs of please do not touch your piercings. And available gloves and optum and cleaning supplies. and more back stock of gloves for all of our employees. And then this with our first aid kit and our fire hazard thing. And this continues down to the old side, which is now just our checkout lobby. Um, so we have water available, catalogs available. Uh, eventually we'll have snacks and whatnot available for clients as well, just a nice little seating area. We have all of our aftercare up here. We have more gloves and Optum wipes available for employees, our dope candy jar, all of our aftercare available for purchase, and our checkout till. On the back of the saline counter, we have extra drawers that basically are just for various till things, so all of our waiver forms with their integrators uh, stapled to them. Till things, till stuff, and more till stuff. And then we exit out this way now, where we just get them to unlock the door. And that is our studio. Yay!